My research applies uh, modern microelectronics to medical device applications. So the challenge in developing new medical therapies is designing and developing drugs is becoming less efficient. And so there's a new field developing called bioelectronic medicine. Leveraging on success and the power of electronics. And the thought is that having a, a new approach uh, will give us new therapies to improve quality of life. Our nervous system communicates through ionic currents and it's possible to, to interface onto these electrical signals using electrodes. So electrodes convert ionic currents within the body to electronic currents outside the body. All our main organs in our body all have communication with the brain and so if we're able to intercept that communication and uh, modulate it in the correct way it's possible to address certain diseases that, that aren't normally associated with the nervous system. So for example, things like rheumatoidal arthritis, diabetes, asthma, these are all conditions that progress because of our body's inflammatory response. And so it's possible to suppress our body's inflammatory response through um, modulating the nervous system. And so by interfacing to the nervous system, um, we can avoid certain conditions uh, possibly in the, in, in the future. I think we've already seen impact in hearing, in cochlear implants, in movement disorders, things like Parkinson's disease, central tremor, um, dystonia. But we're going to see this technology being applied to more and more conditions out there. Closed loop therapies for epilepsy, devices for visual prosthesis, so helping the blind see again. But also the, there's a huge application space to dementia and to mental health.